Hey everyone, welcome, and if you're new here, my name is Adrian. I'm just going to be doing a routine feeding here for the red wigglers in my stainless steel worm bin. So I'm going to take these off and go ahead and take a look. Make sure there's no worms on the top here. It's good. Alright, let's see here. Alright, so. Oh, wow. <laughs> little worm right there. This is where we fed them last because this is the banana leaf, and they have basically completely consumed that. Let's go ahead and move this over here. Take a look down here. So what I will be doing today is moving their last feeding area over this way. So I'm just kind of getting these leaves out of the way. Lots of wigglers here. Well, there's an apple rind there. Lots of worms. Last thing I put in here was some oats, some overnight oats that I had done with uh, a lot of soak in apple cider vinegar. Um, this is a, a meal of ours that I just had some, some leftover stuff and I put it in here and they, uh, they appeared to really enjoy that. I mean, that did not last long at all. Worms look good. Lots of little use in here. Oh, yeah. They're like, leave us alone, we're warm. It's a beautiful day here in Texas. Oh, some more guys here. This looks like some bedding that got kind of matted there. Man, this, this material is so, is looking really good. Actually, I'm going to try to bring this over just a little further here. Banana peel. All right. That looks pretty good to me. And I'm starting to wonder if I fed them further this way. I think it's just that this bin is very well populated. I mean, 
there's worms everywhere in here. So with that being said, I'm just going to go ahead and feed them, I think, somewhere in this region over here. So we'll go ahead and jump into that. Move this over here. And I've got a bunch of, uh, this is just egg carton here that I'm going to be breaking up into smaller pieces here just so it'll be easier for them to consume. More surface. We'll go ahead and just throw this stuff in here. This will be. This will also act as a great uh, moisture abs absorber, absorption. I guess you could say it'll it'll really help because you know when I put this oatmeal in here that I'm gonna put, it's got a lot of moisture in it, so this will kind of soak that up and then prevent the uh, bottom of the bin from getting overly moist and collecting too much water down at the bottom. And we're actually going to move this over here to this side. All right, that looks good for now. I'm actually going to put just a little bit of grit down at the bottom. And then this is the uh, the oat, the oatmeal that I saved for these guys. I'm just gonna put it here on top. And this one I, I let soak overnight as well before we ate it the other day. And uh, I soaked it with apple cider vinegar, which they seem to go crazy over. I don't know if it's like, you know, that fermented the cider or whatever that's in here that uh, also helps to kind of kickstart the, uh, you know, helping it to break down to be easier to digest. I'm not sure. All right. That looks good to me. I'm going to go ahead and Sprinkle a little bit more of this on top of here, the uh, powdered eggshell. And then this one I've got just some dried oats and uh, flour. I'm going to sprinkle that on there as well. This is going to be a really good carb, high carbohydrate meal for them. <laughs> All right. And then I'm going to put just a little bit more on top of the eggshell powder. All right. Now we're going to add some of our bedding some more bedding on top of here just like this All right, and I think I have a little bit more over here. Got to make sure they're getting their carb, the carbon in their diet as well. All right, that looks like a great meal right there for them. All right, so what we're gonna do is take our um, bedding over here that's already being cons been consumed quite a bit and we're going to take that and just put it around top. Just like so. And then we'll check back in on this in like a, a week or so. Piece of wood there. We'll need that. I'll put this pine cone here, and then we'll bring the leaves back over. But what I want to do before I cover that is 
put something to, so I know where I fed last. So I'm going to actually put this piece of paper here on that side. Then I'm just going to cover everything with the leaves. They really seem to, to enjoy the leaves that I've put in here. And I think it's, I mean, just for me personally, I feel like it's a good, uh, kind of gives it more of that natural habitat feel, you know, in my mind. Maybe they don't care, but I feel like they, I, I do feel like it, it matters, but all right. That looks good to me, guys. Hey, thank you all so much for watching. If you enjoyed it, be sure to smash that like button. And uh, we'll see you in the next one, all right? God bless y'all. Bye-bye.